Well, one of the major elections this changes this election year has to do with where you vote. Now, the state shut down many of the precincts because of budget cuts. KITV4's Dick Allgaier continues with our team coverage. Dick? Some voters who haven't heard about the changes may go to their usual polling place tomorrow and find it closed. Entry school, one of 75 polling places that will be closed tomorrow because of budget cuts. There will be 97 polling places like this across the state closed with no signs to redirect voters, no explanations. That's why we ask voters to check um, where their polling place is before they actually go to the polls. You can do it online. Uh, you can call our office. You can call our office on election day at 453 8683 or you can call 211. But the easiest is a polling place locator found online. Just type in your name and your birth date and it'll tell you where to go. Got all that? What about seniors who don't use computers? I don't even try to tell them that. <laughs> Although I myself, you know, I'm a retired computer programmer, so I can do it, but many people my age don't go onto the internet. Pearl Johnson of the League of Women Voters says many seniors have already voted. More and more are using absentee ballots to avoid confusion. They're telling me that they've already voted absentee. They said that it's so much easier to do that. Election officials say more people have used absentee ballots in tomorrow's primary than used them in the last general presidential election. There is big interest in the important races, but election officials say they don't pay attention to that. As election administrators, we really don't pay attention to who's running. We just want to put on the election, you know, pick, get people to vote and uh, get out the results. To find out where you should vote, you can check our website at KITV.com. If you don't have a computer and you're not on the Internet, you can call 211. And if you have any problems voting, please let us know. You can send us an email tomorrow or call us or send a photo to you local. Paula and Laura.